to another review. So today we're doing an eyeliner, and this is by Beauty For Real, and it's from their Eye Line 24-7 Gel Eyeliner line, and this is in olive. So obviously it's like this really pretty olivey metallic green shade, which I will swatch on my hand for you guys. It's like a nice skinny one. If you use the side of it, it's like that. If you use the tip, it's just as skinny, but like... Otherwise, it's like a really nice shade. I'm trying not to press too hard because I don't want to dull it down on my hand before I get to my eyes because that would suck. <laughs> but, um, yeah, let's go ahead on in. I'm really curious to see how this is going to hold up on my skin because I know certain gel eyeliners we have established on this channel just do not do well with my skin between having oily lids but also hooded lids so it's like usually it's like a whole on shit show when it comes to gel eyeliners but there's a couple brands that can do it well to where even my lids seem to be okay with it so let's just kind of start at the middle there and go across you know i like it chunky so this is fine for me if you have like a better method that works for you do it but for me i like my Big, chunky, 60s eyeliner, because that is just how I roll. Okay, I'm undecided if I want a cat eye or a wing or anything today, but I may just stop there, but... Ooh, that is a pretty color, and look how much bigger it makes my eyes look, just from that. Just from that alone. Yeah, it's nice stuff. Yeah, I think I'll probably just stop there today and then do the other side. La 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 la. I should have done this side first, holy crap. If anybody's wondering, yes, I did dull it down, and no, this one does not come with a built-in sharpener, so I'm kind of fucked. <laughs> That's alright. Again, I kind of don't care, so it works for me. It's okay. It's all right, my dudes. Okay, so I mean, honestly, it's not the worst. Is it even even? Oh, not entirely. I know there's a little patchy spot there. Alright. Probably about as close as we're gonna get, though. I mean, I'll pick it up a teeny bit there. Alright, that's closer, I think, so. I'm putting along those lines anyway. Yeah, so it's like an interesting, slightly patchy formulation. I'm not thrilled about that part. You really have to, like, go over it a lot. So it's not patchy. And every time I think I have it, I notice another spot where I'm like, ugh, really? <laughs> So, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about this one yet. We'll see how it wears throughout the day, because, I mean, that will be the main thing. Let's see, does it smudge on the hand? Oh, well, that's a good sign, because, I mean, I'm going really hard, and it did not smudge at all. So, that is actually a really good sign that it might actually hold up throughout the day. But, again, we'll see, because I've said that before and then gone and eaten my words later, so we'll just have to see how it does, but so far, I like how it looks, I like that it's not smudging, but 
we, we have yet to monitor the situation and make sure it stays that way. So, update on the liner situation. It's been like all day almost, and it hasn't smudged even the tiniest little bit. Like, are we seeing that? That is insane. That is insane. Holy crap. This thing is getting top marks from me, guys. Top marks. The fact that it can hold up to that without the tiniest bit of smudging. Like, I want the entire line. I wish they made more colors of it because they only make five colors in this collection. But, oh my god, I want them all now. <laughs> I mean, if they all work like that, hell yeah, sign me up. So anyway, yeah, five out of five from me. Would recommend wholeheartedly for anyone. <laughs> so anyway, that's it for this one, guys. So as usual, you know what to do. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. If you're not already and you'd like to be, click subscribe. Hit that notification bell icon so you never miss an upload. Leave comments down below. Make sure you're following my social media accounts, my Facebook fan page, my Twitter, my Instagram, my eBay, my Reddit, everything and more. It's all down below. And if you like what I do here on this channel and you'd like to help support it, the donation link, as always, is down in the description. Anyway, guys, till next time, see ya.